Hello everyone and welcome to Ivy's Coupon Camp. Um, I'm new to YouTube, so hit like, subscribe, and send someone to my page. Hit that bell so when I post another video, you all can come visit my page. Um, I'm really trying to get my YouTube viewers up because um, I've been couponing for nine years and I get a lot of questions about couponing on my Instagram page and my Facebook page and I also teach couponing classes and budgeting classes so I also will be coming at you with budget buddy tips of the day uh, the one I posted yesterday somehow got deleted so I will be posting that over again um, now I have a CVS haul and before I get into my CVS haul for the week of 422 I want to talk to you about brand loyal. I was asked the question, did I did I only buy name brand items? And the answer is no. I do not only buy name brand items. I am not brand loyal. As you can see, CVS Beauty 360 and CVS Health. That was a good haul for me this week. So that's the haul I did. But I also bought Scott Tissue. I love Listerine, so I bought Listerine. And I didn't get any bucks back for that, so I bit that. I only pay a dollar for my Mitchum because I got back a $2 off the older and the Mitchum was $2.99. Oh, matter of fact, I got the Mitchum for free because I had a dollar off coupon. So the Mitchum was free. Okay, so let's get into this. The Physician's Formula, spend 15, get 10 back. The Mitchum was free. I pay exactly $4 for the two Listerines because I use two of the dollar off internet uh, Listerine coupons. And then I had a $2 off of six of um, Listerine products from CVS, so I bought that. Then I got the Eucerin, which was $10 off back in bucks for $20. I bought the Almay, which was $4 back if you bought $10 worth. I bought three of the Scott Tissues, which was spend $20, you get $5 bucks. I bought the three garbage bags from the CVS Health and Beauty or Cleansing Home Household. Sorry about that household and um that will spend 15 get five back the towelettes was a dollar because they gave me a three dollar off and they was four dollars so i got those for a buck when you look right here at the cvs toothbrushes they have a sale if you buy three of those three toothbrush mouthwash or the dental floss which i did not get you could do this deal twice. You get three bucks back on each one. So I just uh, reached my limit. So I got three packs of toothbrushes. And I got three small mouthwashes. Because I have some people going um, to college this year. And um, those will come in handy. Then if you mosey over here to my non-name brand CVS Beauty 360. I got two of those. And I bought... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight body washes. And after I did all of that, I got back five bucks for spending 20. So all together, I get I made 45 bucks. And I spent $9.50 out of pocket. This is what I call a deal. I used $49. In month in our CVS bucks the exact amount of the total with cash was fifty four dollars and fifty cents so all together I use about nine bucks give or take with the taxes our taxes in Illinois is sky high they are ridiculous it's nine percent so when I talk to you about getting what I used out of pocket. I'm not adding the taxes on to there. But 
in this case, I did because I wanted to let you all know. I used to could get the things in El in Illinois for like dirt cheap. This probably would have been probably about three dollars. But when the taxes shot up, it just I, it's bad. it's so hard to do it now. So I want everyone to take a good look at that. All of that for nine dollars and fifty cents. Now, can you all hit that bell, like, and subscribe? And I will be posting my budget buddy tip of the day again because somehow it got deleted. I'm new to YouTube and guys, so if somebody could come and view my page and um, recommend me to some more people that really need some tips on couponing, tips on budgeting, tips on freebies. I'm the one to come to. This is a nine-year stint. Trust me. Thank you all for watching.